Oh, it was just um, at a hook here. Um, Jamie and I really liked it and thought, good opportunity to get involved and yeah, thought we'd have a crack and they were keen to sell it, pass in at Cracker, but you know, it's grown up nicely now. Yeah, been working for a couple of years and family's involved with it, so thought it was good investment and stuff like that. So yeah, I saved up just from, just from work and stuff and couldn't really sleep last night, so I was pretty nervous. No, it'd be, it'd be pretty cool. Create more opportunities to invest in some more or whatever. Yeah. I'm nervous, eh? Nervous? Yeah. Good to go? Yeah. I'm happy I'm not leading it though, I'd be like twice as nervous. Good luck. Yeah, thank you. Good luck to you too. How's it going? How are you? Good luck, mate. Thank you very much. Thank nice. you. Good luck, Harry. Good luck, Harry. I'll follow you up. Bye, mate. Get up, Hunter. Sorry. Up here. Right, ladies and gentlemen, I hook you off a lot 15. Well, it's very special to have Harry Chittick here. Harry being the third generation of the Chittick family to sell horses here at Inglis. Of course, over the years, Gary started it, Mark continued it. And now Harry's taken the baton up, and I'll tell you what, very, very nice to have this Super Seth Colt here. Who's got 50 to start him? 50,000, thank you. Five and a hundred thousand dollars, seven hundred thousand now. Someone else has chimed in too. It's around the corner, out the back. 200. 200. 200. 220. 220 now. At 220. At 240. At 240. At 240. At 240,000 dollars, seven to 240. At 240,000, but I sell him. Last chance. Done. 240,000. Thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. I'm with a young Harry Shiddick. Harry, you are 18 years old and you have just offered your first ever horse at a sale. A super set out of Believe You Me. And you were so nervous last night you couldn't sleep, you told me. Yeah, no, it was an unreal feeling. I couldn't sleep last night. Real nervous, but no, it's all, all worth it and paid off, yeah. $240,000, what were you hoping for? Oh, just anything more than I paid, really. <laughs> I was pretty, no, no, I was happy for anything, no, it was, yeah, it was awesome, yeah. What's the experience been like um, on this side of the, the fence being a vendor for the first time? Oh, it was pretty cool, eh? yeah, no, it was real nerve-wracking, I don't know how people do it like that every day, but, well, no, every day, but every sales, but, no, it was real cool, yeah. What was it like in the vendor box as you, uh, you watched that price climb? Yeah, well, slowed down for a bit there, so I was getting a little bit nervous, but no, I picked up, so I was yeah, stoked, yeah. Now, what are your plans for the rest of the day? Are you going to go and help Jamie out with the rest of the draft, or are you going to go toast your own success? Oh, no, I just might enjoy beer or something, but yeah, yeah. Well, massive congratulations, well done, and we hope to see you back at a ready-to-race sale in the future. Thank you so much, thank you.